Hi everyone, this is Louis. Today you're gonna learn how to paint your own canvas background. Okay, to get started, we're gonna need five things. A canvas, a paint tray, paint, water, and a textured roller. As far as the canvas, I found it online at Bleak Art Materials. I made sure the canvas was already primed. That way I didn't have to do anything to it. I could just roll it out and start painting. The canvas that I got is 72 inches wide, which is perfect for shooting one model at a time. If you're shooting group shots or family portraits, I would probably go a little bigger, so it works better for you. The total length of the roll is 216 inches. I'm gonna be cutting that in half, so from the same roll, I'm gonna get two backdrops. For the paint, I went to my local Home Depot and got acrylic exterior flat paint. I really love going to the paint section because you can compare all the swatches and you can get inspired and you can find the color that you really want. For this canvas, I knew I wanted to use a olive green color and guess what? I found a paint that's named Olive and also I, I knew I wanted to use a darker shade of gray so I found a color that I thought it would work great and it, it actually did and I ended up using those two colors. For your base color you can use a regular roller so you can have an even tone across the, the canvas but um, in my case I used the texture roller so I could start getting texture as soon as I started painting. For my base color, I used just a little bit of paint and then I mixed it with water. It depends on how thick you want the paint to be when you start off. Um, you can add less or more water. In my case, I used a lot of water because I wanted to start building texture little by little. For my second coat of paint, I started combining a little bit of the darker shade of green so I could start building the different tones and textures. For my canvas, I wanted the center to be lighter and then get darker on the edges. So I used my texture roller and started painting from the outside in, um, but mainly focusing on all the edges. What I ended up using was a sponge. I would just soak the sponge in paint and then I started splattering my canvas but also following the same idea going from the outside in so it has the same effect but when you splatter the paint gives you a different type of texture as you can see painting your own canvas is super simple it's up to you you can get creative you can get all crazy and add different colors and shades do whatever you want. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions, please uh, go to the comments. I will be checking them out. Or if you want to send me an email, please do so. And more than anything, I would love to see what you guys create. I created this video so we can learn together, create together, and hopefully we can inspire some other people to do the same. So. This is Louis Cárdenas, and until next time, gracias.